Dream Universe Worldwide Wrestling Cup November Week 4. And we are in the final 128 bracket with uh, the second week of Cup wildcard matches. Starting off with the opener, we got Pac at power ranking 112, Brian Cage at 111, and a five time AEW tag champion. And then we got Omas at 209. Qualifier winner. Match number two, we got Cactus Jack at 110. A former two-time WCW Hardcore Champion. Damon Kemp of NXT 109. And Ricochet, our qualifier winner at 207 and former Intercontinental Champion. Match number three, we got NXT's Bronson Reed at 108. And a former NXT champion. Stevie Ray of WCW won half of the Harlem Heat at 107. And Swerve Strickland of AEW, our qualifier winner at 201. Match number four, we got AEW's Ricky Starks at 106. Former five-time AEW tag champion. Uh, another AEW superstar, Malachi Black at 105, and then Kurt Angle at uh, 197, our qualifier winner. Match number five, we got Yokozuna at 104, NXT's uh, Drew Gulak at 103, also a former NXT North American champion, and our qualifier winner, AJ Styles at 194. Match number six, we got Eddie Kingston of AEW at 102. Jerry the King Lawler at 101 and former two-time WCW Hardcore Champion. And AEW's qualifier winner, Matt Hardy at 191. Match number seven, it looks like an all AEW... Uh, match right here orange cassidy orange cassidy nick jackson and big bill all from AEW. orange cassidy coming in at 100 and is a former international aew champion nick jackson at 99 uh is and is the current two-time aew tag champion and big bill our qualifier winner is the current AEW TNT champion at 187. I mean, so all three are uh, former champions. This, re- this should be probably like one of the most competitive matches out of the whole card. And then our main event, Samoa Joe from uh, AEW at 98, Conan of uh, a- uh, WCW at 97, and then Jay Uso, our qualifier winner, former three-time SmackDown Tag Champion at 183. So we got a lot of a lot of champions, former champions on uh, current champions and former champions on tonight's card. Starting off with Pac at 112, Brian Cage, former five-time AW Tag Champion at 111, and then Omas, our qualifier winner at 209. The following contest is an elimination match. Making his way to the ring from Newcastle upon Tyne, England, weighing in at 205 pounds. Peck. Ruthless aggression is alive and well, and this superstar is living through. And his opponents. First, representing the team 
from Sacramento, California, weighing in at 272 pounds, Brian Case. This is a competitor who isn't happy with him. Look at the size of this man. Seven foot, three inches tall, 400 pounds. The true colossus of WWE. And from Lagos, Nigeria, weighing in at 400 pounds, the Nigerian giant, Omas. Three superstars in the ring, but only one victor in this triple threat matchup. Hashtag triple threat. Simple rules. First competitor to earn a fall, whether by pinfall or submission, will be the winner. The rules may be simple, but nothing is going to come easy in this fight. I assure you of that. Ooh, bombing more than the chest. Oh, running FTO plants him. Nicely done. Uh-oh. Answering back.
Oh, it's locked in. The cross face. He's got it locked in. It's locked in. Now trying to reverse the pressure. Elbows finding the mark. He's a free man. Oh, can he score the pin? Gets the shoulder up and one. Still has enough energy for the simple kick out. one. That's what he does. Keep on the attack. 
And what he's looking for here looks like a potential submission maneuver coming. Hits the cross face. Oh, this one's over. Tap out coming. Trying to reverse the pressure. Elbows finding the mark. He's a free man. Reversal! What a counter! Oh. Effective arm drag. He is getting shredded apart right now. Yeah, this will pull off some form of offense here. Slips out of the way. Cinched in. It's not embarrassed. After all that punishment, he had no choice but to tap out. And a final elimination. This one's over. Here is your winner, Peck. And we are looking at the last superstar standing in this matchup. I have to say, I'm just as impressed by this win as the WWE Universe. Triple threat matches are no joke. And Pac takes the first win on tonight's card via submission and will advance to the second round of this Worldwide Wrestling Cup. All right, on to match number two. We got Cactus Jack, former two-time WCW Hardcore Champion at 110, Damon Kemp of NXT at 109, and Ricochet, our qualifier winner at 207 and former Intercontinental Champion. So we got uh, two former champions in Cactus Jack and uh, Ricochet. So uh, it's not looking too good for Damon Kemp in this match. Well, here comes a hardcore wrestling icon who is indeed ready for a brawl. The following is an elimination match. Making his way to the ring from Truth or Consequences, New Mexico. Weighing in at 287 pounds, Cactus Jack. You don't win or lose against Cactus Jack, guys. You, you just simply survive. Yeah, easier said than done, Michael. Cactus Jack has proven he will go to any length to win. And guys, what a thrill it must be for these superstars to compete here on Thanksgiving. Especially considering what this... The new gold standard in WWE. And his opponents, first, representing Diamond Mine from Apple Valley, Minnesota, weighing in at 220 pounds, Damon Kemp. Damon Kemp now looking at... We're about to see an air show. One of the best aerialists in WWE history. And from Paducah, Kentucky, weighing in at 190 pounds, Ricochet!
Elimination rules in effect. Gain a fall on your opposition to shrink the field down until you're the last standing. And it's a stacked field with Cactus Jack, Damon Kemp, and Ricochet. Look, it doesn't matter if you eliminate one or 100 people in a match like this. All that matters is the superstar who gets the very last elimination is the one who gets their arm raised. Possibly easier said than done, but what is it here in WWE? Implanted by the DDT. In a matchup like this, Corey, what is something the competitors need to remember? Well, a major difference in a triple threat is that you can lose a match without being part of the decision. Victory can be stolen from your hands in an instant. That's why in this match, a competitor must be cunning, calculated, and move with silent speed. Both competitors showing how well they know one another. That'll hurt DDT! Oh, wicked kick to the lower back. He's taking some good hits. Cactus on the receiving end. From behind, back suplex. Face gouge, oh God. I see how it is, going to take any shortcut to bypass a clean competition. Hey, there's nothing wrong with a shortcut, Saxton. Get his press. Big clothesline. Ooh, treading all over the opponent. Punch right in the head. To interrupt the attack. Oh, Ooh, what a knee lift. Tackles ruthless. Ah, uh, look at this. With a power of ricochet. Into the pin attempt. She just kicks out. Couldn't quite slam the door yet. This match grinded him down a little. Jack wards that attack off. Great wherewithal on the counter. Able to elude it. There was some power behind that punch. Neckbreaker. That holds back Cactus Jack's attack. Up into a fireman's carry position. Oh, fireman's carry and a rolling hills. Damon was ready there. Textbook. He can do it here. Kick out close to three. This could be a tipping point in this match. Cut off with a kick to the gut. are no cake wall, and they are showing the... Will this be enough? No! Kick out for Ricochet! They got close there. It could be do or die time. Ooh. Going right after the neck. Neck breaker! He skirts around it. Their opponent's arm, trapping their knee for more punishment. Lands face first. Punch right in the head. Textbook fireman's carry takeover. What a headbutt. Vicious. Double knee backbreaker. Ricochet. Paying homage to his idol, The Rock. And The Rock never did it this pretty. People's moonsault. Acrobatics like that take a tremendous amount of cardio and strength. Into the panic kick. Continuing to work on the arm with a, and a carefully measured knee drop. Oh, wicked kick to the lower back. Cactus Jack's face turning into a mangled mess. Gonna carry the last bad spot to be in. Cactus Jack. DDT. Is it enough to overcome Cactus Jack? And he's still in the game. Unbelievable presence of mind. I thought he was unconscious. 
just throwing everything in the kitchen sink in there, but to no avail. And he only stays down for a one count. There is no quit in this man tonight. Nasty kick to the face. He's expressing pain. Cactus Jack setting him up for the pain driver. Will Cactus put it away here? Cover! Two! And a kick out. No one saw that coming. That was a miracle, gentlemen. I don't know how, but Ricochet stayed alive. It is unreal that this match is still going on after a maneuver that would end most matches. Getting in with that form. Opponent goes down, so it's a great agility for the German suplex. Wow! Ricochet heads up, thinking high risk. Great counter by Ricochet. A counter answered by another counter. Oh, strong impact. And Cactus Jack gets put into a bad spot now. Cactus Jack has to get hurt himself, has to regain some composure now. Clearly waiting for that. Textbook fireman's carry takeover. And Kemp showing he still has fight left in him. That's Damon physically willing. Will it be? Understand the sentiment, but now is not the time to bask in disbelief. What are we about to see next? What last neck breaker? Oh, suplex. Wait a second. Ricochet setting it up for the <laughs> people's moonsault. He got whipped into that corner. Elbow throw saying not today. Wait a second. Takes a melee. Great athleticism. Rolling elbow right on the mark. Carefully placed stop to the arm. Switches it back around. Legs caught. Oh, what a close line. Yeah. Cactus Jack setting him up for the ball driver. Ricochet fell that one big time. Two. Somehow he kicked out. Unbelievable. Ricochet drew on everything in him to kick out. Yeah, but can he mount a comeback? That move has brought victory before, but not on this occasion. Might Hooking them up.
Up into the electric chair. Oh, oh my God, the German Hollings. And a nice takedown. If this works, it could cheat. High risk. Nobody home. Way to wear this from Ricochet. What a boot. He's going for it all. Ricochet heads up, think, are you kidding me? The guy's not kidding me. 6.30. But can Ricochet close this? Shoulders down. And it's Ricochet that picks up the win. Here is your winner, Ricochet. What a tremendous effort from all three superstars involved in this hard-hitting triple threat. I applaud all three of these superstars for pulling off a match like this. And what a competitive match. That was Ricochet coming out with the W and being the third qualifier winner to advance to the uh, second round of the Worldwide Wrestling Cup. So, uh, congrats to the former Intercontinental Champion. All right, match number three. We got uh, Bronson Reed at 108 and former NXT Champion. Stevie Ray from uh, WCW at 107. And Swerve Strickland, our qualifier winner at 201 from AEW. The following contest is an elimination match. Making his way to the ring from Adelaide, Australia, weighing in at 330 pounds, Brad Sound Reed. The moment this match was announced, the W. And his opponents. First, representing Harlem Heat from New York, weighing in at 292 pounds, Steve E. Ray. It may not be cool. And from Tacoma, Washington, weighing in at 220 pounds, Severn Scott. Already so confident on the way to the ring. That's not confidence, Saxon. Three superstars with one goal in mind, but there can only be one with their hand raised at the end of this triple threat. I've competed in multiple triple threat matches, and the most challenging aspect is making sure you stay in the mix. Make sure you're always just an arm's reach away from any opponent. Paying it right back with a reversal. Down by the DDT. Flying Majorana, beautiful. Showing off the quickness, that'll turn things around in a hurry. And that was some brutal impact on that DDT. He had it scouted. Right. Placed in the corner. Uh-oh. Oh, oh, are you, you kidding me? Back of his neck. Up is down and down is down. 
is up after a move like that. Nicely done. Uh-oh. Caught with that sharp elbow. Oh, my God. Pendulum backbreaker. Tick tock. And Corey, a superstar's odds of winning in a triple threat match are significantly less than usual, correct? Well, my Steiner math's a little rusty, but that is my general understanding. Yes, you need to be fully aware of your surroundings to keep your chances up. Slam, what an impact! Whoa, stiff headbutt. Ah, kick from behind. Ouch. Hooked up. DDT. He's absorbed some damage already. In triple threat, the damage comes twice as fast. He knew that coming in. Good contact. Hit drop. I've been waiting to see that. Break that up. 
Sequence of reversals there. Look at this going counter for counter. And he's able to inflict more damage there. He's so persistent. Keeps bringing the fight with no remorse. That was a hell of a maneuver there, guys. Threat match, you need incredible skill, instincts, or luck. Dare I say, tonight's winner showed all three in victory. Whose house? Swerve's house. And Swerve becomes the fourth qualifier winner to advance to the second round of the World Wide Wrestling Cup. Congrats to Swerve Strickland. On to our fourth match. Ricky Starks of AEW ranked 106 and a former five-time AEW Tag Champion. Malachi Black of AEW at 105 
And Kurt Angle is our qualifier winner at 197. The following contest is an elimination match. Making his way to the ring, representing the team from New Orleans, Louisiana. Weighing in at 194 pounds, Ricky Sparks. A matchup like this, it's one that the... And his opponents, first from Amsterdam in the Netherlands, weighing in at 215 pounds. Talk about an intense competitor. This superstar doesn't have it all. Make way for a wrestling machine. Weighing in at 237 pounds. As if this match wasn't compelling enough, when you throw in the no disqualification stipulation, it gets even better. These competitors can use barricades, steel stairs, announce tables, heck, even outside interference. Nothing is off limits here, and they will let their imaginations run wild. You're right, Corey. This is hardcore all the way, and the WWE Universe can't get enough of it. He deflects it right back. Kick to the midsection, sunset flip, now oh, into a powerbomb. Picture perfect example for when you just want to put someone down with authority. That's not right. That was just wrong. You should be a better person than that. Feeling the effects of that last hit. Double the opponents means double the danger. He better have a plan. We know you have to watch your back at all times in a triple threat match. Any other advice, Corey? Yeah, here's some for free. Let the other two superstars battle it out as much as possible and for as long as possible. The more time you can spend out of the action, the better situated you'll be to come in at the last moment and deliver the finishing blow yourself. Angle switches it up. And he easily stops the ref's count. Channeling his energy to stay in this matchup. Wow, he reversed angle. German suplex. Reversal. Can he take advantage? He's locked him up. German suplex. German suplex released. Boom. Here it comes. Lights out at this connect. The bicycle knee strike. High knee right between the shoulders. Ah, oh, jeez. His shoulders are down. Kick out at one. 
showing his determination there with that. Uh-oh. Oh, the power, the strength of the Dominator. Gonna take an Olympic effort to recover. Two count and a kick out. Kurt freaking angle just built different. And he's reminding everyone of that right now. True fighting spirit on display from Angle, kicking out like that. That was the home run shot that got robbed at the fence. Oh, an intense street slam. He is just reeling from that offense. After lasting this long in a triple threat, it'd be a shame to take a nosedive now. Hits him with a gut wrench suplex. What impact! A beautiful Northern Lights suplex. The beginning of the end. This has been a colossal battle to this point. No, that should do it right there. Evading offense. Perango picks the leg. Looking to end this here. The ankle lock is in. Uh, he's in complete control. Opponent has nowhere to go. Could be tap out time. A normal man would have submitted by now, but. And he's able to fend off what must have been a grueling submission. There's a wheelbarrow. Nice amateur takedown. All the way over. This is it. He refuses to stop. Oh, kick out. Kicked out. He kicked out. You got a question. How much is it worth? How much is it worth to continue through the agony? It's obviously worth everything. Obviously worth Swift on the ground. Exhibiting a uh -oh. On the power of the strength of the Dominator. That puts him in total control. Cover. That's it. Crazy has been eliminated. Oh, a shot right to the kidney. Oh. And again. Wait, wait, wait. Where's the opponent? From the heavens. We are witnessing ridiculous standing shoot into the cover. Oh. Stopping the ribs counted too. And you gotta think he's just one final blow away from not kicking out next time. That it was good night. You have to wonder how much more can he take? And you gotta think that all the plans are out the window after that. And the corner he goes, a perfectly 
placed target into the bulldog. the rest of their competition in this match. Three superstars absolutely giving it their all with one breaking away from the pack in the most dominant way possible. What a match. What a win. Ricky Starks advances to the second round of the Worldwide Wrestling Cup. But what a match between Ricky Starks and Malachi Black. Man, that was that was good. All right, on to match five. That's too bad for uh, Kurt Angle. was really uh, pulling for him. Kurt Angle didn't, too good, didn't do too good in the rankings on Raw. So the guy could just couldn't catch a break. All right, on to match five. We got Yokozuna at 104. Drew Gulak, former NXT North American champion at 103. And then our qualifier winner, AJ Styles at 194. Six foot four, over 550 pounds. The following contest is an elimination match. Making his way to the ring from the land of the rising sun, weighing in at 558 pounds, Yokozuna. opponents first from philadelphia pennsylvania weighing in at 193 pounds drew gulak don't judge ladies and gentlemen here comes the phenomenal one a man who exceeded all expectations in WWE and is now a first ballot Hall of Famer. And representing the OC from Gainesville, Georgia, weighing in at 218 pounds, the phenomenal AJ.
No disqualifications in this matchup. What does that mean for these superstars? Well, this is the type of match where superstars really show their true colors, are given free reign to be as aggressive and ruthless as they desire. It means someone's leaving in an ambulance. That's what no disqualification means. Trying to fight with a hurt arm is no easy task. Shining Wizard! That's right, Corey. That was a Shining Wizard. Double smash! Enable the counter. And the DDT! Oh, no, 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 no. disqualification match. You lean into the stipulation and leave no stone unturned. Use everything at your disposal to get the win. Otherwise, what's the point? Reciprocating the initial. 
partial reversal. Reversal from Gulak. And an elbow. He turns it around. Ooh. in trouble here. Style positioning his opponent. And the styles clash. Yokozuna looks out of it. Two. Oh, kick out, kick out of two. And the Heyman's like Yokozuna kicking out of that. That's to make you wonder what it'll take to keep him down. And just what else can AJ do right now? He got all of it, and it wasn't enough. Up and over, all the way to the floor. AJ Styles rolls through into the cap pressure submission. Will he tap? But he makes submission maneuver here. And look at the pain his opponent's in. How much punishment can he tolerate? Ah! He breaks up the holes. And he sends him into the corner. Reversal. Can they go to the attack? Distribute an attack. I don't know how much more Styles can withstand. Yeah, I think these competitors expected this to be a difficult challenge. Even so, at this stage, things just get more and more dangerous. Fatigue starts setting in, and you don't know exactly have all your wits about you. They can quickly lead to error. What energy in the arena tonight? Uh-oh. surviving an 
ultimately thriving in a match like this. This is the kind of action you get when you put three hungry competitors in a match against one another, forcing them to battle for supremacy. And AJ Styles is the fifth qualifier winner to advance to the second round of the World Wide Wrestling Cup. That makes five cup qualifier winners advancing to the second round of the of the World Wide Wrestling Cup. <clears throat> they must have they must have had the the wrong superstars at the bottom of these power rankings by 2k but uh congrats to aj for winning his match via submission against yokozuna who had the momentum but couldn't pull the trigger and we've we've seen that before all right match number six we got uh eddie kingston of AEW at 102 jerry the king lawler at 101 and former two-time wcw hardcore champion and then we got Matt Hardy of AEW, another qualifier winner at 191. <clears throat> so Jerry is the only uh, former champion. Looks like uh, he's to be uh, favored in this match, but you never know about those qualifier winners, man. for this a triple threat match one fall to a finish between three very hungry competitors egos feelings and bodies are about to be hurting this one cole that's just what happens when you add a third to the mix get his press chop off the body slam elbow drop Stinging right to the back. Look, the most intelligent competitor in a battle knows that there are many roads to victory, including the low road. Oh, close line. <laughs> Placing them into the corner. He knew that was coming. Boom, nice. Ooh, ouch. Turned that one around. Ooh, that 
can knock you out. Corey, in your mind, what's the best strategy to take in a triple threat match? Unfortunately, there's no one right answer. These matches are too unpredictable to plan for, but a good rule of thumb is to be aggressive and control the action in the ring. Uh, King fights back. Big open hand. This is right for him. He's looking a little off balance. In triple threats, the damage comes twice as fast. He knew that coming in. Northern Lights bomb. Goodness. And if you're on the receiving end of that move, you got to be rethinking a few things. That is, if you can think at all right now. Eats a punch to the face. Larry. Inverted atomic drop. Ooh, look at this. Here. Back, 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 back
time. Submission locked in tight. Nowhere to go. No escape. This could be the end. There's no way he survives this. No way. And he escapes the submission before things got more disastrous for him. Set it up. Nice neck breaker. Uh, King fights back. Where's the honor in that? Uh-oh, this is not going to look pretty. Submission being applied. Abdominal stretch. It's locked in. This is a great way to wear down your opponent. Oh, just tap out. Just tap out and end this thing. Losing this. Abdominal stretch. Fighting out of That's it. That's one way to get out of it. For comfort. I can see it in the eyes from here. Disbelief. Unbelievable how this one is still going on. Uh-oh. Oh, yeah, the side effect for the win. Two count. Oh, he's out at two. This started as a match. Now it's a test of will. The pillars of this building must be crumbling from the energy. Some serious endurance, I'll give you that. And I think to get the pinfall, you have to try that maneuver one more time. Oh. Oh. Not a king, Jerry Lawler, the world favorite oh. power Big opening for Lawler to take this. Into a sleeper hold. And into a neck breaker. The WWE Universe has come alive in this one. They are up and they are vocal. A lot. Lights up. Big opportunity for him now. Try to end it. Oh, and he just kicked out. I can't believe that this whole arena is in shock. Yeah, but no one's more shocked than the man who thought he had a pinfall. Man, it might be time for a change of strategy. His best move didn't get the job done. Wards off that offense from Lawler. He reverses it. Superstars 
can still be moving at this point is beyond the realm of reality. Uh, King fights back, targeting the throat there. superstars in this match this was an unpredictable one but when it was all said and done only one man could be left standing one man out of three it was always bound to lead to a little chaos Well, I was pulling for Eddie Kingston, but Jerry Lawler got the nod. And it's no uh, surprise either. He is a former two-time WCW Hardcore Champion. So Jerry advances to the second round of the Worldwide Wrestling Cup. Match number seven, we have all AEW superstars in this match. And all of them are former or current champions. So we have Orange Cassidy at uh, is the current two-time AEW Tag Champion, one half of the AEW Tag Champions, and then Big Bill at 187, our qualifier winner, and the current AEW TNT Champion. The following contest is an elimination match. Making his way to the ring from wherever he wants. Weighing in at 182 pounds, O.J. Cassidy. This superstar is... First, representing the Mega Bucks from Rancho Cucamonga, California, weighing in at 178 pounds, one half of the AWA World Tag Team Champions, Nick Jackson. Here's a competitor. Queens, New York, weighing in at 275 pounds, the television champion, Big Bill 
If this person spent as much time focusing... Corey, how important is it for a superstar to use their surroundings to their advantage? It's vital. Since there are no rules, anything can be used as a weapon against your opponent. Anything can be used in an attack when an individual is driven by malice and fueled by rage. It's a battle of attrition. Adrenaline makes you do crazy things. Locks in the gut wrench. Suplex! Oh, God! Face first! Tilt the whirl into the arm drag. This is just brute power. Release German! In a no disqualification match, you never want to be the superstar on the wrong end of a chair or a kendo stick or whatever else might be hiding under the ring. You want to be the one inflicting that punishment because that's how you control the pace and the match as a whole. And sent right into the corner. Oh, stuck between the corner and a splash. He saw that one coming. Setting him up for the flatliner. Tilt the world into the arm drag. He needs to be careful. You don't want to be the weak link in a triple threat. And he's able to reverse. Left kick. Oh, man. Hold on. Plants him. Getting tossed around. Not the prettiest thing you'll ever see, but it sure looks effective from here. Control. Oh, 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 what a boot. You see the Messiah was definitely unbelievable athleticism. <laughs> Into the armbar. That was amazing. I have no idea. Scores his way out. Oh, what a close line. Gets him with the counter. This is going to be stiff. Back drop suplex. Uh oh. Oh no. From behind. Oh boy. First he thinks he has it. Quick count after one. Shows that this is still anybody's match at this point. Headlock takeover. Slowing down the pace. Tremendous pressure applied. Uh-oh. Look at this! Uh-oh is right. Fallaway slam! <laughs> Face first, here it comes! Hold on! Handle. 
Look at this, just unloading. And a Ooh. stop to the gut, too. Really just laying it in. And I think we just might see. Uh oh. Stay down that attack. And heavy hands to follow. Stay drop kick. Great ups. Hooked up. Showing a lot of fury with these attacks. Things are really going his way now. Let's keep fighting. And oh my God, what a fall! That's a jump. He's going back to the road. Uh-oh. He moved, but can he capitalize? Back drop. Watch this Herculean power into a back suplex. at a point where these superstars must be hurt, must be vulnerable. And who's going to find a way to capitalize on that vulnerability? Unbelievable athleticism. <laughs> Into the armbar. That was amazing. I think he's got it locked in good. I just don't know how to counter this thing. I don't want to... his way out. Oh, close line. Move that wins 
matches. Two. He, no way. No way. Oh, I thought that was game over. Pure guts to kick out there. And you can sense the desperation mounting as that last move couldn't finish things. These superstars have toiled away endlessly, and this crowd is on their feet in full appreciation. An incredible sight to see. He's got him scouted. To the face. Reversal after reversal, proving the end of only. Is he willing to endure in this match? How draining was that? Can it be done again? Oh, I don't care who you are. You can't survive any more of those. He's still in this fight. Are we sure that wasn't three? Uh, just about as close as you can get. All of that work, all these big moves, and it still didn't earn the fall. Counter after counter. He is revving up the engine. He's not going to let anything stop him. Oh, my goodness. We've got to acknowledge these fans have packed arena, and we're hearing every single voice. It is loud, and it is mad in here. Foot to the belly. Back in the seat. Did you see that? Oh, just deadlifting their opponent. Tossing their opponent like they're nothing. survived against enormous odds in this elimination match. Yeah, with an elimination match, your number can be up at any moment. But they've managed to outmaneuver all the other competitors here tonight. And Orange Cassidy defeats the big man, Big Bill, in a bloody match to advance to the second round.
of the Worldwide Wrestling Cup. Congrats to Orange Cassidy. And as we get higher in these uh, power rankings, the more competitive these matches are getting. All right, our main event is here. Samoa Joe of AEW at power ranking 98. Conan of WCW at 97. And our qualifier winner, Jay Uso at 183. A former three-time SmackDown Tag Champion. The following contest is an elimination match. Making his way to the ring from New York, weighing in at 282 pounds, the Samoan Joe. The tension built. And his opponents. Representing the Wolfpack from Cuba, weighing in at 254 pounds, Connor! Just look at... Main event, James Uso. Representing the Usos from San Francisco, California, Weighing in at 242 pounds, main event, Jay Uso! A little one-on-one -on -one action here. A triple threat is possibly one of the most challenging matches a superstar can agree to. No rules, no friends. And even if you weren't friends beforehand, a triple threat match makes enemies of everyone. It's easy to overthink going into this match, but the best way to ensure victory here is to adapt to every moment. Ooh. A match like this can have so many twists and turns. Corey, what will have an impact on this matchup? You need to strike first. Dictate the pace of the match. Since anything goes, you can add anything to the equation. Each competitor responds differently to the rules being thrown out the window. The key is who can stay alert and remain in control. I wish someone would throw you out a window. Denied via a wicked punch to the stomach. Tried to make quick work of things and almost succeeded. Kick will 
stop me in your tracks. Taking out the knee. There he goes, right into the corner. He finds a counter for Jay. Kick right on point. And Jay took a solid hit that time. It's expected, Paul. In a triple threat match, the target on your back is twice the size. Oh, look at the knee strikes. Precision strikes. Oh, impressive counter. Kohina clutch. Kohina clutch. Kohina clutch is in. Time to go night-night. I'm not quite sure if this man shouldn't tap out. This is about career luck. Does he have the wherewithal to break the submission? Yes. Yes, he does. Oh, man. Well, 
There's the reversal. Nice handspring evasion. Kick.
triple threat match. Here is your winner, Connor. And there you have it, the last superstar standing. Yeah, it may sound cliche, but you have to keep your head on a swivel in a match like this. And our winner did just that. And Conan gets the win and will advance to the second round of the Worldwide Wrestling Cup. Congrats, Conan. And that is it for today. We will catch you guys in the next show, which will be Survivor Series War Games. Pay-per-view coming up next show. Thanks for watching. Have a good night. God bless.